Have you ever wondered why your pen does not work properly after some time of use? Have you ever had the ink not close properly? If not, then congratulations! You are maintaining your pen properly. Hello everyone and welcome in today's video. Today I will show you how to clean your Pilot Parallel pen why to do it and how to do it in the best way so as not damage it without wanting to so that you can take advantage of it for a maximum period of time so before we start make sure you've subscribed to the channel if you don't want to miss any of the upcoming videos thank you before i show you exactly how to do it i want to add that i was one of the people who were of the opinion that what is the point of cleaning that pen? It works flawlessly anyway. I do not think it would be a problem. Just replace the capsule. Well, friends, I was wrong. And I understood it in the hard way. Okay, now I will tell you why to clean it. Okay, why to clean it? I have been using a parallel pen since I started calligraphy, even this was my first pen I bought. After using it for a while without resting naturally, let's open it, I noticed that the ink does not flow properly and smoothly. At times it destroys my inscription and sometimes it is difficult to get out on the paper. What turned out? Due to irregular cleaning, the ink had dried between the nips here I will show you between these two metal nips hope you see it and also inside the base here then guess what I had to buy a new parallel pen don't make my mistake now I will show you how to clean it and what you need. So you will need of course a parallel pen, a mug full of water, a paper, you can do without paper. This let me take it. This little squeezing pipette that is included in the kit when you buy the pen and also this little black plastic that's included in the kit too here you can see it so the first thing you need to do is to unscrew the back of the pen so that you can release the front of the pen which contains the ink cartridge and the nib. Then carefully separate the cartridge from the base that holds it and separate it somewhere to the side so that everything does not become in ink. So you see the result, how my hands look. Let's take it up and it away so now the most important part what you need to do let's take the detached part of the pen put the pipette from the kit and put it under the water in the cup then start squeezing until you notice that the ink has already come out and the water no longer stains you can see the water, how it changed the color. I suggest you to use gloves because you can see how my hands look now. Then you should take it out of the water and soak the tip of the pen with the paper. Take this little black piece of plastic from the kit and slide it slowly and carefully inside the pen to clear the previously dried ink. After that, take a piece of paper, clean it. You can see now how it looks. 
it's completely clean. Let me ask you here something. Do you clean your pants and your workplace in general after work? Please let me know in the comments below because I'm interested to know. There are various ways to clean your pants such as washing the ink well under the tap until fresh water flows and if you are more daring you can blow your mouth to give a jet and make the ink come out easier. And now you can see now it's completely clean. Not like my hands. <laughs> now you are ready to apply the new color without mixing them. Here you can see for yourself how saturated and clean the color is after cleaning and there are no remnants of the previous color. Look at these strokes, they are awesome. Also look at this color I choose, it's amazing. What do you think about this color? It's amazing, isn't it? Please make sure you already click the subscribe button if you don't want to miss the upcoming full videos. This is the easiest and free way that you can support me if you enjoy the content that I made. So thank you if you are already a subscriber and welcome to the journey. If you enjoyed this video and was useful to you, then you probably enjoyed this video. So if you click on the screen right now, you can go and watch that. Thank you for your time, see you later.